are close enough. So this is boy Boyfriend Trainer for Devious Vacuums, um, Girl Games Thread. This is a game about hitting, abusing your boyfriend whenever he does something less than perfect. Great like, messages. Like looking around? Like looking at other girls. Um, this is found on Addicting Games under the Girl Games category. And I am pretty sure Addicting Games is owned by Nickelodeon, so... Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, okay. Off to a fantastic start. Also, the same girl has walked past, like, four times. <laughs> yep. That time, I, I just hit him. Just to show off the animation. Boy, and that time, I wasn't sure what he was looking at. It sure is an addicting game, I must say. Yep. Yeah, just clicking one thing every five seconds. If that... More or less. Game of the year. <laughs> Game of the, the year in this, our year of Luigi. The cold, unblinking eyes of the women walking past. Yep. And I... There's a lot of things wrong with this game. You think? Oh, never mind, they do blink, it's just very rarely. So, so now, as the screen shows, you will no longer be looking around anywhere. Well, yeah, because you probably knocked his eyes out of his sock and all that stuff. So this, in this level, any time he drops something, you have to tase him. And the way the game works, at any point during the animation of him picking it up, you can tase him, I believe. How did that even happen? That's not his fault. It fell off the counter. <laughs> Yep. And a couple of times it looks more or less he dropped it because I tased him, so... We got some lovely music going on. Yeah, this is some fantastic yep. music. Right? I don't believe the music changes at any point. This guy's really bored. He does the same three things. Yep. He's also the clumsiest man alive. To be fair, you clumsy too if you had someone tasing you over two seconds. I think all of his nerves are fried by the stun gun. He's also gambit without a pole. He also looks sort of like a werewolf. That might just be me. So in this level, you have to hit him with a tennis racket. Whenever, whenever he changes the channel, or tries to drink the wine that is on the table. I'm just assuming the girl left it there just to tempt him. Because... Seems like... the kind of game. So what are the two shows on the TV? There's, like, football and then it looks like Mortal Kombat. <laughs> I, I believe it's supposed to be dancing. It's like Shitty Dance Central. Yeah. Except without the connect, which means it's better than Dance Central. How has he not suffered a concussion yet? I think he's suffered several concussions. I mean, you're hitting him pretty hard! Eh, it's a tennis racket. He'll be fine. He's a resilient man. Man, this must have cost like $60. This is too much fun. <laughs> Let what is the... What's gonna happen? Oh. Out of curiosity, what is the failure state in this game? Should you choose to not be a horrible person and, you know... Um, it's basically... I, I kind of wish I included that now, but it's him, like, cheering and the girlfriend looking really sad and it says, Oh, he got away. Oh, he's free! Jeez. What the fuck? Also, that was some great, uh, dialogue back there. You own him. You own the remote and you own him. Yep. Yeah. This this level we have to strangle him with a leash that for some reason he's wearing. Whenever he drives too fast or try or puts the radio on too loud. That's some safe driving. And I, I was fortunate enough to be able to do it in one try when I was recording it. But I'm pretty sure this level can actually be impossible to complete at times because of the time limit and how long the animations take. 
So it's a well-programmed just... game. I will never get over his strangled face. He looks like a fish. I'll never get over the fact that the leash is clipping through the back of his head. Yep. <laughs> game design. And now oh, we have yeah. a perfect boyfriend. Sure, so we that do. was boyfriend trainer. Well, that was a thing. <clears throat> I still think he looks like Gambit. 